Good morning and grace and peace to you from God our Father and our Lord Jesus the Christ. Amen. I'm running a little bit late again this morning. I've started a few times and then I got distracted as we have company that just showed up. But let us pray. Blessed all the words of my lips and the meditations of our hearts and minds, that they may be acceptable in thy sight and glorify thee, O Lord, our rock and our redeemer. Amen. The reading I'm sharing this morning is from Galatians chapter 4, verses 4 through 7. It's from the King James Version, and it's the epistle reading for the Sunday, the first Sunday after Christmas. But when the fullness of time was come, God sent forth his son, made of a woman, made under the law, to redeem that were under the, them that were under the law, that we might receive the adoption of sons. And because ye are sons, God hath sent forth the spirit of his son into your hearts, crying, Abba, Father, wherefore thou art no more a servant, but a son, and if a son, then an heir of God through Christ. Here ends the reading. The time came that God had chosen. You hear that. God chose a time, and he chooses the time for when Christ will come again to take all who believe in him, all of his children to himself. And we are his children, for the Spirit of Christ dwells in us, and we are heirs of that glorious kingdom that Jesus has gone to prepare for us. Thanks be to God, who is our Father, that we who are not his children are now his children by the gracious gift of his beloved Son, his only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord. Amen. <laughs> 